So if you've ever had a contact lens stuck on the eye or maybe a lens stuck underneath the eyelid, then this is the video for you because we're gonna walk through some tips on how to remove that contact lens that's stuck on the eye safely. Let's take a look. Hello and welcome, this is Dr. Alan here from the Dr. Eye Health Show, helping you learn all about the eyes and vision. And today we're gonna jump right into it. We're gonna help you remove a contact lens that's stuck on the eye. Whether you are watching this right now and you have a lens stuck on the eye, or maybe in the future, if you are a contact lens wearer and you just happen to have trouble with this, uh, these tips are gonna help you out. Now there are two ways that a contact lens can get stuck on the eye. Either you are just wearing it normally, you can tell that it's sitting on the eye, but you're trying to remove it again and again, and it just is not coming out. The other way is that the lens can be stuck underneath the eyelid and you're worried that somehow that lens is getting behind the eye and like getting back to your brain or something like that. Rest be assured if that is going on like right now and you're worried about that contact lens being like stuck behind your eye, don't worry. It's impossible for that to happen. There is a clear coating on the eye called the conjunctiva that not only follows the eye about halfway up but then loops back around onto the eyelid and that prevents anything from getting actually behind the eye. However, with that being said, if you've ever had a lens stuck underneath your lid, you can definitely feel it. It's not very comfortable, so I know how you feel. Now, let's say in the first case, you just have the lens on the eye. You can tell it's still there, but you're just having a hard time getting it off. You've been trying over and over and over again. Your eye is probably pretty angry, red, and irritated. So the first thing to do is just take a break, kind of chill out for a second, uh, close your eyes, blink a few times, and just calm down. If you try to aggressively kind of reach at that lens and you keep going and going at it, you can end up actually poking yourself in the eye or scratching the eye, and I don't want you to end up with anything like that because that could lead to a true emergency with the eye. So again, just take a break, chill out, and let's go over a few steps that'll help you out more. Now, if you have not already, make sure you wash your hands and make sure your hands are clean because you don't want to be touching your eye or putting anything in your eye with dirty hands. Uh, that could just make things worse. But the next big tip is that if you get the lens is stuck on the eye and you can't get it out, put some sort of lubrication in there, whether it be an eye drop specifically meant for contact lenses, or even if you have a multi-purpose disinfecting solution, sometimes you can put that a little bit of one or two drops of there inside the eye as well. That'll help flush the lens around, give you a little bit more lubrication behind the lens so it almost flushes floats off the eye because some contact lenses do seem to dry out over the course of while you're wearing them and they can almost like suction onto the eye. So giving a little bit of lubrication can be helpful. However, a quick pro tip is that if you are using the multi-purpose disinfecting solution, don't use the one that has a red cap on it because that's a hydrogen peroxide solution and that could end up burning your eye. So again, not with this red capped one. Now the real secret to getting this lens out after you put any sort of lubrication on there is to make sure your hands are bone dry. They have to be absolutely bone dry. Once they're bone dry, then making a little kissing motion with your fingers, you just simply hold open your eyelid and then grab and remove. I know I make it look a lot simpler than it probably is for you, but I, I swear, keeping your hands bone dry and just trying at it again and again, eventually you will get it. Okay, now for the next part. If you have a contact lens that's stuck in the eye and underneath the eyelid, that's a little bit different story. First of all, I think if you have anything stuck in the eye, it could be an eyelash or a contact lens, then blinking frequently sometimes helps. That gets your eyelid moving, and so the eyelid can eventually push things out of the eye. That's kind of just the nature of the eyelids to begin with. Oftentimes here in the clinic though, when we have somebody that does have a lens stuck underneath the eyelid and they come into the clinic so we can remove it, the real big important tip, and I've done this myself, is to look downward. So usually the lens isn't stuck in the lower eyelid, that comes out pretty easy, but it's underneath the upper eyelid. You wanna look down away from the lens and you wanna look a little bit toward your nose. So if it's stuck in my left eye here, I'll look down and toward my nose and you can usually feel where it's at. If it's up over here in the corner or off here to the side, you can kind of feel where it's at. And you want to kind of push the lens and you want to kind of just kind of move it a little bit with your finger and you want to keep pushing it down and that'll encourage it down toward the open part of the eye. Once you feel it get toward the open part of the eye, you can either again blink several times and it'll just fall right out or if you need to again with your clean fingertips, you can go ahead and reach in and grab it out of the eye. 
Sometimes if you have a family member or a friend there to help you, they can help see where it's at and coach you through it. Otherwise, if you have like a mirror, you can try to see it, but I know if you're looking downward, you're likely gonna have a hard time seeing when it's at the edge of the eyelid. This technique usually works the best if the contact lens has rolled up on itself or is folded in some way. Usually, again, you can feel a lot easier and just be able to push it down. But on the off chance, the contact lens is still its normal fitting and it just happens to be suctioned to the eyeball itself Itself, then sometimes not only pushing it downward, but then doing the exact opposite and looking up toward the lens can push that lens back onto the front surface of the eye. And then the lens likes to settle on the cornea a lot easier than the white part of the eye. So sometimes, again, if you're troubleshooting, uh, try not just looking down and moving it down toward the center, but then also looking straight and even upward toward the lens that could maybe help it slide into place. And then the final tip here is that if you still are having trouble getting this lens out, out, then definitely flush the eye out. Whether you have eye wash, like a sterile saline eye wash that you can use and flush the eye out with, or again, in this case, if you do have the multi-purpose solution that is not the hydrogen peroxide, the red cap bottle, then again, feel free to try and flush the eye out, get some fluid moving, and see if you can push that lens a little bit more toward the opening of the eye. Now, hopefully after trying a few of these tips, you were able to get the lens out. The eye is probably gonna be a little sore and irritated. If you can, don't put the contact lens back in, go back to just wearing glasses. Otherwise, to kind of just improve the comfort of the eye, feel free to use a lubricating eye drop, maybe something like a gel eye drop may be a little bit more comfortable just because it'll give the eye a little bit extra padding. If by chance you're not able to remove the lens, then of course call your eye doctor or local eye clinic so that you can get seen and have that lens removed easily. Otherwise, of course, in this whole process, if you did happen to poke or scratch yourself in the eye, you're in pain, you have a red eye, your vision is blurred and is becoming a problem, then again, do not hesitate. Give your eye doctor a call so they can help you out. Now be sure to let me know in the comments if you have ever had a contact lens stuck in the eye or underneath the eye that you just couldn't get out. Did you ultimately get it out? Did this video perhaps walk you through the steps and you were able to get it out just watching this video? Let us know in the comments section because I'd love to hear your feedback. Otherwise, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you found it helpful, smash the like button for me and subscribe to the channel if you're new. If you want to learn more about contact lenses, finding the best ones for you and your eyes, then go ahead and check out our full series by clicking or tapping the screen over here to the side. Otherwise, again, this is Dr. Allen here from The Dr. Isle Show. Keep an eye on it, and we'll talk to you soon.